In this video, we're gonna teach you how to make the best out of your gulp baits. Uh, if you've been watching our videos at all, you know that we really love gulp baits. Uh, the, the downfall is that they are expensive and, and also that they, they do require some maintenance. So this video is gonna teach you how to maintain your gulps so that you get the, the most benefit from them, the most value from them, you can catch the most fish on each one. So first of all, as far as upkeeping, uh, as far as maintenance is involved, if you're not careful, gulps will completely ruin your gear. You can see these are the exact same two tails. If you leave the one over here in my right hand, uh, this was left outside in the sun, so it completely dried up. If you let this dry up while your hook is still on it, your hook is gone. It's ruined. This is this is this rock. This this one, this small one, is just rock hard. Again, it's the same exact uh, bait. This one dried up. This one uh, kept its uh, its liquid. So. Always make sure if you're not using them as soon as you finish, put them either back in the container they came in, again, immediately take it off the hook, put it back in the container, or uh, more importantly, I guess my biggest recommendation is to get one of these waterproof cases. So I, I have this waterproof case, I keep this on the boat, and I just put all the gulps that I use in here, and you can see it actually has some of the, the, uh, the gulp juice in there. So as far as getting started with this, you can buy these at Walmart, anywhere, they're around five, six dollars. They're just really convenient. And I usually uh, just get one of these and then buy you know, one of these gulp, the bigger, kind of the bigger boxes, use the juice in here, and basically use the juice in here to, to keep, this, keep this liquid. And then uh, you can buy, again, you can either pull these shrimp out and put them in the, in the bucket, or uh, my personal favorite, these green, these green gulps. So I just buy these in the packets because they don't sell them in the, uh, in, the, in the bigger style. So I buy in the packets and just pull all five of them, put them in here and keep using it until it's done. So uh, again, another point too, uh, here's another uh, show of shrinkage, if you will. The, this yellow one, um, this one actually, this didn't happen overnight. This was out in the sun for a, a few days in a row. Um, this white gulps, this gulp shrimp, you see it's on the jig head. This jig head is now ruined. I'm gonna have to, to throw it away. But this was only left outside for one day. So after one day, this white gulp basically uh, halved in size. So always be sure to, to take these things off the hook when you're done. And so the, the, the final tip is, is once, you're, uh, once you're done using them, make sure that you wash off your gear. So whatever hook uh, you use um, for the bait, make sure to wash it off because whatever kind of material that they use uh, in, in that liquid, it really makes, at least for my opinion, it makes the hooks rust sooner than they would otherwise. Uh, one bonus tip, so if you are using these, uh, these jerk baits, like the jerk bait style, is to use uh, these types of hooks, uh, and uh, this one in particular is made by owner, but the types of hooks that have the, the little twist at, at the tip, where you twist the actual bait on, it'll make the bait last longer um, compared to like the old worm style hooks, where it's just the, the bend in the hook. The, the twist feature allows you to catch more fish with each one because it doesn't damage the front end uh, once you catch a fish. All right, we hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below. If you want to see the, the very details on exactly where to use these gulps, when to use them, how to rig them, we have a, a Plus membership. So check out the Plus membership on saltstrong.com. Go to saltstrong.com, click on the member section up top, and you'll be able to see all the details on, on how we rig and use these things if you do join. So anyhow, thanks again for watching. See you on the next video.